What's going on, nephew? Listen here. With this being your last day of high school, I gotta tell you. With your daddy being in jail and your brother following in the steps behind him, you are literally the only person left in this family that can do something with your life. You are the only person who is going to college in this family. So, what you gonna do when you get to that college football level? What you gonna make happen? South LA where a teenage boy is dead after a shooting. We have learned a person of interest has been detained tonight. Deputies say gunfire erupted just before four o'clock this afternoon after multiple fights on Western Avenue near West 108th Street. As deputies swarmed the scene, they say a large crowd ran away. The teenager was found on the sidewalk with gunshot wounds. He was rushed to the hospital but did not survive. His identity has not yet been released. What is going on, man? Welcome back to another video on the channel. As y'all can see, we're on that NCAA 25, and we got my boy AJ here. And as y'all can see, we're going to be playing that quarterback position, starting off as a five-star recruit. Because we, we like that. We like that. Now, I know y'all seen the intro. We got to go hard. We, we, we got we, we to gotta go out. All out. You know, go big or go home. So... We come into the season with a, with our heads up, trying to trying to get everything right. But if you guys like the content, make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, hit that post notification button. So you know whenever I post or go live. And without further ado, let's jump in here and see what we get into. Hey, AJ. I'm a local reporter doing a story on your college decision. I just have a few questions for you. Which of these do you see as most important? Competing for a national title? getting NIL opportunities, becoming a starter early in my career, or improving my abilities quickly. Y'all already know, competing for that natty. Okay, which of these would you say is also important to you? Playing in a prestigious conference, seeing the field as a freshman, or making the league one day? Making the league, obviously. Come on, man, come on. And finally, which of these is important to you? Say to the art of athletic facilities and God, I can't speak. Say to the art, athletic facilities and locker rooms or coaching staff with decades of experience. Obviously, if you can't coach right, we ain't going to play right. So welcome to National Signing Day. Once you've selected your school, your college football career begins. If you have aspirations to see the field early, pay close attention to the depth chart. And even if you didn't get your dream scholarship, you can be a walk-on at any school. Plus, there's always the transfer portal if you need a change of scenery down the line. All right, now looking here, it looks like we got some good schools that won us already. We got Arizona State, Washington State, South Carolina, South Carolina, Michigan, which is a five-star. Michigan, which is a five star. And as you can see on the right, we got our high NIL opportunities. Auburn, Iowa, Minnesota, Stanford. But what I'm noticing most about these is that the job security is not as high. And from my looks of it, I will be taking my talents too. Welcome to the family. Always excited to meet the next in the long line of Michigan greats. Go blue. Yo, your boy is going to Michigan. Oh, and we're going to have a great go, season. Welcome to your freshman year. It's time to spend the skill points you have already earned to upgrade your player. Additionally, each week, you will need to manage your workload. Activities like practice will earn you coach trust. And as your coach trust increases, you can improve your spot on the depth chart and gain more play calling flexibility. Now, let's get to work. All right, so immediately I'm looking and we're gonna have to put this on. We have to put this on our, on our uh, I, either IQ or accuracy. 
Let's see. I think IQ, I think we can do IQ for now. Let's throw that on IQ. Then we gonna, we got one more. We're gonna leave that. We're gonna save that. But uh, looks like we're gonna go ahead and advance a week. We in the preseason right now, freshman year. We also got to make sure that we stay on them books because there is no such thing as slacking. You arrive as part of you arrive as part of a talented recruiting class with high expectations to help lead this team to potential playoff berth under the new format. Who will you learn on to? Who will you lean on to help with? I'm gonna. Who will you lean on to help you deal with that pressure this first year? I'm gonna lean on my teammates. Leadership increased. Come on, man. I'm cooking. I'm cooking. I'm cooking. Welcome to Michigan, AJ. This entire coaching staff is glad you're here. I wanted to give you some information before you start your first season. It's a lot. It's a lot. It's a lot. But we're going to go ahead and give a polite answer because this is coach. We want coach on our side. You feel me? We want the coach on our side. So we got to buy a week, our first week. But we got some energy points that y'all can see in the top right. We got some energy points. So immediately, we're, we're putting it in the books, man. We're putting it in the books. Off the rip, we're putting it in the books. I'm telling you, we are not going to be doing any type of slacking. Any type of slacking. So let's go ahead and get into week one, where we should have our first game. Y'all already know we QB1. Come on. Let's get into week one, where we should have our first game, and it's against Fresno State. Who gonna take their first loss? The victors valiant, the conquering heroes, and they call home the big house. Bathed in maize and blue, welcome to Ann Arbor, home of the Michigan Wolverines. Today, we have one of those games that tests your focus. Top 25 team against an unranked opponent. Can you take care of business? As we'll see a squad from the Mountain West, the Fresno State Bulldogs. Taking on the ninth ranked team in the land, the Michigan Wolverines. There we go. There we go. There we go. Come on, we can get this CD, man. We can get this CD. There it is. There it is. Oh. There it is. There it is. Oh. All right, we're getting some. We're getting some play time. Let's see if we can get us a touchdown here. Ah, dot. Come on. Let's do it, man. Come on, come on, come on. Third and six. Boom. First down. Got it. Let's go. Oh, we didn't get it. We didn't get it. Oh, they got the first. They got the first. Come on. Yeah. Let's go, man. As y'all can see, it's 20 0 in the second quarter. Look at that dot. Alright, we're back in the game. So we can cook some. I'm looking at circle and I'm looking at triangle. I'm looking at circle and I'm looking at triangle. Wow. A weak ass block, man. Weak ass block. Let's 
Weak ass block. Dot. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. We got 58 seconds to score. Looking at square and I'm looking at. Square and circle. Damn, man. They not blocking for real, bro. They're losing their blocks. All right, R1 and R1 and triangle. Got a dot. Oh, oh, I thought I hit it. I thought we completed it. All right, we need this one for real. I'm looking at triangle. Boom, there it is. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, man. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah, give me in there. Come on. Let's get this touchdown. Boom. Touchdown. Let's go. Really cooking. It's 27 to 0. Now, I didn't told y'all somebody was going home with a first L and it was not going to be us. 31 to 0, them boys. You know how insane that is? 31 to 0. We starting the season off right. Are we advancing a week two? Offensive coordinator. Texas is a quality ranked opponent. I don't want to ask too much of a freshman, but here's a challenge. Complete a 40 yard pass and don't throw any picks and win, of course. But can we do it? Can we do it? A 40 yard pass and don't throw any picks. I'll be your academic advisor. We're glad you chose to attend the prestigious academy institution, yada, yada, yada. We're going to thank her because like I said, we're going to stay on the books. We, we ain't gonna do no slacking on them books. We got our first NIL deal. What they offer? Two week contract for the cost of one energy. You receive 500 followers each week. We'll take it. I get. I, I guess we'll take it. I guess we'll take it. But uh, we got some new energy points. Go ahead and apply them. We only got four. Like I said, going on the books, man. We're gonna put the last one in our leadership. We're gonna go ahead and simulate through the through the practice because it's only literally like two things to do. But uh Texas at Michigan. Can we complete the challenge? Hi everyone and welcome to the big house. This massive crowd assembled here today to cheer on the Wolverines already chanting go blue. This is not just any other matchup. Both teams come in ranked in the top 10, colliding early in the season, each trying to set the tone with a big statement. As we'll see the number three team in the country, the Texas Longhorns, taking on the seventh ranked team in the land, the Michigan Wolverines. 3A Sports College Football, I'm Chris Fowler, here in the booth with Kirk Herbstreit. I think we've talked long enough, Kirk. Let's get to this game. All right, come on. First play of the game. We need a 40 yarder. Ah, uh, they got ah uh, first play the game. Come on, we gotta go with that 40 yarder. We gotta go with a 40 yarder, man. Let's see if we can hit it for real. Ah, right there. We oh, got it. And he's going. Oh my God. Let's go. How many yards is that? Are right, we in the red zone? We in the end zone. So let's try and get us a little touchdown here.
There it is. There it is. Let's go. They they didn't score two field goals. And now it's seven to six. So we gotta lock in and do something there. I don't wanna keep up with these running plays, but I can only change the play so many times. And these running plays are not getting us anywhere. Here we go again. They didn't score it again. It's fourteen to thirteen. It's fourteen to thirteen. Oh, I just threw my first interception. Wow. No way. All right, let me lock in, man. I can't throw no more interceptions. That, that was a bad look. It's the first interception of the season. First interception of my career. scored man they scored come on we gotta lock in bro we can't we can't no more of that i i thought i threw another one oh come on we gotta go deep I, 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 that's what I get for talking shit on these running plays, man. That's what I get. Take me out the game, coach. Oh, I ain't gonna talk no more shit about these running plays. Come on. There we go. Oh, we didn't get the first. It's all right. It's all good. It's all good. Okay, we got the first. Let's go. I ain't talking no more shit on these running plays. Ah, what I am gonna talk about though are these blockers. They don't block for shit, man. They don't know what blocking is. All the way, come on. Oh my God. Come on, let me make up for it. Let me make up for it. Let me make up for it. God damn. Brother, where is my blockers at? Where is my blockers at, man? God. There it is. Come on, first. Get over the line, brother. Oh my God. Surprised they're letting me control the the fourth down. Surprised they're letting me control this fourth down. There it is. Touchdown too. Give it to me. Give it to me. Give it to me. Oh, bro. He couldn't jump it. Here we go. Give us a touchdown. Give us a touchdown. Give us a touch. Yeah, I said I wasn't going to say nothing about them running plays. My last play switch right here. My last play switch. There it is. There it is.
Don't look on your social feed today. You and the team are getting roasted pretty bad. So I can ignore it, criticize the coach on social media, make a burner account to defend myself, or criticize the fans on social media. We're going to go ahead and ignore it because the bounce back is going to be 100 times better. We got a brain decrease, but that's it's all right. What part of throw no picks do you understand? No wonder we lost. I get you young, but that was a huge missed opportunity. Man, if you don't, <clears throat> I'm gonna hold it in. I'm gonna hold it in. But look, as y'all see, we lost 40 to 21. They whooped our ass. But you can't. Uh 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 uh. We, I the bro. I can't. I can't even, man. Our blockers are ass. They're ass. And I don't know how bad I can stretch that. Look, AJ, I know last game was a tough loss, but next game, you got to go out there and get them. Make sure you watch the field and learn your personnel. Keep your head up, kid. Coach, I get that. But how you expect me to go out there and throw 40-yard passes and the O-line can't even block for me the right way? I'll talk to the O-line, but next game you better be on your A-game or some changes will be made. Appreciate it, coach. I promise you next game gonna be one for the books.